being too large for this tank. Uh, not too large for the tank, but too large for me and the aesthetic. So there was a big tank that I wanted to catch out here. So I'm throwing some floating pellet in the water. You're going to see it coming up to the surface here in one sec. A water flow. If you have a lot of fish, you need to feed them well. There's nothing worse than a tank than a tank full of a reef tank full of fish that are skinny. If you have, if you if you make the choice to have a lot of fish in your tank, you need to feed them, and they need to get fat and plump and happy and healthy. Um, so, um, but if you don't have good water flow, then all that detritus and all that waste is going to settle. So, having a lot of fish, there's a scoop. So there comes the tank. So you'll see them coming up here in a second. Uh, right, breaking the surface there, right under the light. So removing fish from a 20,000 gallon tank can be quite a challenge. Uh, sometimes just bringing them up with floating pellet. And you can do this on your own tank. Uh, going in the middle of the night, turning on all your lights, the fish wake up in a scooper, and you can grab them. Um, so here you can see. So the, the tank would have lived its entire life in the tank after, but now you know, you'll see the size of this fish in a second. Aesthetically, he's throwing the proportions off of my You think your coral is big, and a tank is spot, swimming body, coral, dwarfs the coral. Um, and then also, the amount of food this tank is. Uh, this was like having a force in the tank every time I went to the bathroom. Um, so it's, it's a choice. So this is a very important thing, too, on fish choices. I kind of hit on a lot of different topics here. Right? I'm wearing really heavy duty gloves here. Because I had lighter gloves on, and I pulled another tank out, and he sliced right through my gloves, and put my finger wide open. They do call them surgeon fish for a reason. That's fine, it's literally razor sharp. Um, so here, here's a tank, I'm now the proud fisherman, I've got my catch. Laura's taking a few photos for me. It's a pretty strong fish, I'm holding them, and I, of course I want my photo taken with my catch. He starts wrestling me a little bit, and then um, see him jerk around a little bit, and I that's me dropping him back. back <laughs> the tank. Um, and, uh, so here's a lesson in reefing. Have fun with your mistakes, right? 